Hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. And as you probably can hear, I am still a little sick. I'm getting over a cold, so I might sound a little weird. <laughs> um, but that's okay. We are back with my IU journey part four, I think. Yeah, I think so. Hold on, let me check actually, because sometimes you don't you just don't see the time passing and you're just like wait but i think it's part four let me yes part four so i am continuing right now with what i already had on my playlist and again like the things that i i may have missed i will go back to them no worries and thank you so much for leaving links every single time of things that i've missed it is so helpful so Thank you, and I will go back to them. But for today, we are doing Through the Night, Palette, Ending Scene, and Last Night's Story. So, you know what? Without any further ado, let's do this. I do believe that I know Through the Night. I think I've listened to the song, but I've, I haven't watched the MV. So, let's go. Okay, I am ready, and I am excited. Uh, what am I doing? Oh my god, I'm sorry. I confuse myself. Okay, let's go. Wow, she's so beautiful. Okay. My favorite songs like ever. Imagine her singing to you like this, just for you. Mm. 
interesting. Why did she look so sad in the end there? Wow. Seriously, there's something so precious about Ayu. She is so precious. Like, everything from her face to her voice to even the movement she was making, like her, her hands, like, she looks so delicate. Like, seriously, it's just how? Like, how is she a real person? <laughs> like, wow. Yeah, seriously, Through the Night is such a beautiful song. And finally, I saw the lyrics, and the lyrics were beautiful. And even the aesthetics of that music video, which is so stunning. Like, everything about it was stunning. So, now we have Palette, which I think she, she did a bit of it in her Killing Voice, right? I can't remember. She did so many songs. Featuring G-Dragon that I know, obviously, like at this point, like if you've been into K-pop for a long time, if you still don't know who he is, uh, <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> it's, 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 it's a bit weird, but um, I guess let's go, let's dive right into it. This is an interesting collab, honestly, so we'll see. Seriously. The, the way she looks, I'm sorry for pausing again, but the way she looks so freaking adorable with her short hair, but with the long hair, she looks straight out of a, like, of a K-drama. She looks so elegant and she looks beautiful. I mean, she looks beautiful with her short hair too, but you know what I mean? Like, there's this, there, there's such a little, like, contrast, like, even in the way she presents herself, she's versatile. You know what I mean? Like, it's just, yeah. Anyway. Twenty-five. Okay. I don't know who that is. Oh, Corinne! Oh my God, Corinne Bailey Ray. Okay. My bad. Yeah. Okay. Same. <laughs> yeah, I remember that song. I get it. Oh my god. Before we get into it, yeah, because I heard the hey, okay, so we're about to get into the rap part. But it's so funny because being tw like when you turn 25, yeah, it does feel like you're in some sort of a crosswords, crossroad because you can't consider yourself a teenager, right, anymore, like it's over, but you also do not feel like a full grown adult. I mean, it depends on the generation you're in, and I, you being in like wait, like close to my generation i mean we're both 90s kids i truly get it but what's funny is that even at 25 when she's like i feel like i know who i am like like a little bit of who i am now I'm like nah no nah, not even like you think you know but you don't know at least that's what it was for me like 
I'm 33 now and I definitely feel like I know myself way better in my 30s than I did in my 20s. So yeah, my 20s were not the best of times, to be honest. Like I am enjoying my 30s way more. Um, and you know, your brain like uh, still develops until you're 25. So that's also an interesting thing to be talking about. But it's, it's funny because yeah, society has this, these expectations of you when you turn a certain age when really it doesn't really matter. Like you can like whatever you want, like you're not hurting anybody with your hobbies and your passions because that's another thing. Like people think that when you turn a certain age, like you should just stop enjoying anything and being passionate about anything, which is weird. Um, But yeah, I get, I get it. Like I get it. I remember turning 25 and being like, oh my God, okay, like, now it's over, like, my youth is sort of over, when it's ridiculous, yeah, you're still so young. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, that was such a nice verse. But she's also had to grow up way faster than normal, like, teenagers being in this industry, I mean. So I guess it felt different for her, too, to be 25 in this industry. Like, every look looks amazing on her. Like, how? That was amazing. I love that. Okay, next one is ending scene. And I don't remember hearing a bit from this, so I guess let's see. The colors in her MV are always so pretty. shaking that would be me
other go uh, letting go is hard wow that was beautiful come on you can do it that was gorgeous oh my god yeah, I've never heard that song, but it's definitely going on the playlist. That was gorgeous. She really has a way of telling stories that are just so beautifully heartbreaking. How does she do it? How? Like, she conveys so many emotions through her vocals, but also her eyes. Like... Yeah, seriously, I really need to watch her, like, to watch her dramas, because she is such an amazing actress. She's incredible. Okay, the last one for today is Last Night Story. I feel like we're going to get a very different vibe here. I mean, maybe. Who knows? No, we are. Wow, she looks amazing with that hair. Oh my god. Yeah, very retro. horrible feeling so lonely and at a at a party that's like one of the worst feelings ever Look, these guys crack me up Sounds like a song from like the 60s. I love that she's got no expression on her face. It's almost like, fine, I'll dance, whatever. 
I'm just having so much fun here. Like, he spent all night dancing with her friends. I mean, our friends aren't good either, honestly. Guys, seriously, they're so funny. <laughs> She looks so cute with that hairstyle. Oh, girl, you're going through all the emotions. The little smile. Oh my god, yeah, mood. That was really fun. Yeah, completely different. Like, seriously, she does so many different things and different styles. It's always so incredible. I never know what I'm going to get next. And I love that. Ooh, those were like some really, really great songs. I think actually my favorite was Ending Scene, maybe. Just because, I don't know, it was just so beautiful. I mean, Through the Night, like I said, I think is one of my favorite songs like ever. And it's such a beautiful song, but... Something about ending scene was just, yeah, I don't know. It was a combination of, I think, her vocals and obviously the music video and the lyrics that was just so beautiful. So, yeah, I love that. And my God, I just, I love her a lot. Like every, every time I, I go through like more MVs, I'm like, my God, I love her. And I don't know if you can, no, you can't really see it, but over, no, sorry. Over there, there, yeah, there's her album over there, uh, the winning. And you see, if you see pictures there, right here where I'm pointing, it's her. Um, and she looks amazing on those pictures. Uh, the, the entire photo book, this album is gorgeous. Um, and she's got that short blonde hair and she looks so beautiful. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to go through the rest again. I know there's, um, I will be reacting to that too, uh, probably, uh, tomorrow maybe. Yeah, probably because I put in my playlist, uh, the love wins all life clip. Uh, that her official channel dropped. So, of course, I'm going to be reacting to that. No worries. But anyway, um, I look forward to your comments because, again, like, seriously, thank you so much for being so kind every single time and being so excited. Like, she gets so much love and honestly, it's so deserved. Like, I finally understand now the IU love train. Um, I finally hopped on it and I'm hooked and I'm not getting off soon. So yay. Thank you so much for watching with me. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to come and like, maybe subscribe to the channel. You can also follow me here on Twitter and I love you guys. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.